match now. I can tell you, Dominic, he didn't change it at the interval, but he was looking at it a little bit. But his tip looks absolutely perfect, that's Jesus. <coughs> I mentioned at the beginning of the tournament, actually, he felt he could only get away with just playing this tournament with the tip, and then he'd have to change it. But the first two or three matches he played, he was in super form. Strange executed shot by Mark Selby. Double kiss. So another chance for Ronnie to get going. Wow. This just be like a Sutherland to make a very, very sizable break here. Until that shot. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Once again, played that with a little bit of right-hand side. You, know, you can tell that the way it's come off the cushion. Going through the a few mind problems at the moment, but getting very frustrated with himself. Fouls. On your side of the mate. Mark Selby four. pot on the red. He's low on this black, so a little bit thinner. He'll be trying to cannon into the red, just above, below the cluster of the pink. That's okay. If he can get on the one to the left corner, it'll be a big bonus for him. If not, he's got a couple of options. One to yellow corner. If he's near enough dead straight, it'll just be a little drag back. And I think he's playing it with top. Stayed down there. Made sure. Doesn't have the absolute perfect angle on this red to get around the back of the black. May have to play a little stun shot just to widen the angle a little bit. Nice. Nice work out. Perfect. I might see a bit of value, yeah. Playing off this black 
into the reds just above the pink. And he selected to play for the loose red. Make sure this time he's the right side of the blue. I don't think there's anything goes unless this one to the outside that he's looking now of the two. Slide in this left corner pocket. Well, it didn't go, so he's tried to develop some. He is on the red to right corner, so all of a sudden now, so, well, so he didn't want it the other three reds because nothing would have come out there. The white would have just trapped and stuck on the top of the red. So this is now turning into a very good opportunity. 33. Yes, not the easiest of blues to play, and you can only get onto the one loose red there. Just about come far enough now to get to the bottom red of those three will pot the one next to the pink possibly pots as well. Thirty nine. So the lead goes to thirty five for the pink forty one, so we'll need four more of these reds and they're not pink. in great position. That's amazing. You cannot believe how much side he got on that to make the white completely change course. He's played to arc into the three reds that are above the that are above the the black. The ones three in the line, they're the ones he's played. We'll have to have a little look at that again in a minute because I just can't believe how much action he got on that. Forty-five. He's playing to carry it into the three reds that are in a straight line. He's got that much side on it. Suddenly took hold of the cloth and suddenly went sideways. Amazing. Just watch the white there, look. <laughs> Incredible. So the break comes to a premature end at 45. Oh, Ronnie O'Sullivan still in this frame. Selby can't get it this red to right corner. That was a much better safety shot from Ronnie O'Sullivan. We can see it's tight. I think he can just about get through to that red. It is very tight. <laughs> 